Hello my love bunnies, welcome back. Welcome back to my Valentine's Day theme week where every single day this week from Monday to Friday I am uploading a Valentine's Day theme recipe. So today we are making some chocolate strawberry lollipops. So let's get started. So first, to make the lollipops, you wanna set a pot over medium heat and add some sugar, water, and light corn syrup. And I'll have all the ingredients and quantities listed in the description box down below in case you wanna make it. Then stir with a rubber spatula until everything is melted and combined. Increase the heat to medium high, attach a candy thermometer to the pot, and heat until the sugar reaches 310 degrees Fahrenheit. Remove the pot from the heat and stir until it stops bubbling. Add the flavoring and mix until fully combined. And so I'm using strawberry flavoring and I'll link it down below. This is my favorite brand of flavoring. It's really, really good. Then add as much food coloring as you like. I'm using the Wilton Colorite, the pink shade, and I use about six drops to get it this bright. And I'll link the food coloring down below as well. Then use a ladle to pour the candy into a lollipop mold. So if you're using a silicone mold like I am, you can pour the candy directly in. But if you're using a hard plastic mold, a lot of them are clear and they say like for lollipops and whatever, um, you wanna spray it with cooking spray first. Otherwise, it will not leave the mold. It will get stuck and it will be awful. I've been there, you don't wanna be there. <laughs> then stick lollipop sticks into the candy and rotate them several times to make sure that they're fully covered in the candy and this is gonna help them stick inside the lollipops like when you're eating them. Then leave the lollipops at room temperature for two to three hours until they have fully cooled and hardened. Then to decorate, dip each lollipop part way into some strawberry dark chocolate so it doesn't have to be this kind of chocolate. This is just my favorite and it tastes like strawberry so I feel like it's perfect for these lollipops. Then place them on a slip hat mat or a sheet of parchment paper and let them harden just at room temperature for about half an hour. Then melt some white chocolate and put it into a piping bag and snip a small hole at the tip. Drizzle the chocolate on top of the chocolate dipped portion and how cute is this? I love this so much. Then pour the remaining white chocolate back into the bowl and mix it with some matcha green tea powder and this is going to dye the chocolate green. Then spoon the chocolate into a star or asterisk shaped mold. That's just what I had. Excuse the doggies in the background. And then place the mold in the fridge and chill for 30 minutes. Then just unmold and use some extra green chocolate as a glue to stick them onto the lollipops. And you are done. So thank you all so much for watching. I hope that you like this recipe. Make sure to subscribe if you don't wanna miss out on the rest of the week's videos. Tomorrow is a doggy recipe and it's so cute and you'll get to see my doggies. So make sure you stay tuned. I love you guys so much and yes, I'll see you tomorrow.